Hey, 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 what's going on, everybody? It is Guy Esme, and welcome back to another video. Today, we are reacting to SML Movie Junior's Valentine's Day gift. So, I thought there wasn't going to be an SML movie coming out today because it was almost it was almost 9 o'clock. It's clearly almost 10 o'clock. This got uploaded a few minutes ago. And uh, so far, I've been enjoying my break. I had a good day today with my girlfriend. So, I'm ready to react to SML, so let's can the chatter. You ready? I'm ready. Let's do this. Junior, tomorrow's Valentine's Day. Yeah. Junior, are you excited it's our first Valentine's Day together? Yeah, it's fun. Junior, come on, pay attention to me. Hold on, I'm playing Black Up Free Zombies with my friends. But Junior, Valentine's Day. Look, I'm on round 32. I have three pack of punch guns with mule kick. I have speed cola, double top root beer, and juggernaut. I can't go down right now. What? Look, Cody has the water waffle. Hold on. Oh, you bitch! Oh, you bitch! Turn it back on! Junior, come on! Let's talk about Valentine's Day! What about it? You're supposed to get me something! I got you the best gift ever! It's the greatest gift ever! You've always asked for it! Really? Yeah, it's in my closet! Oh my god, Junior! You do love me! I'm gonna go home right now and go straight to bed so I can wake up and it's Valentine's Day already! Stupid bitch! Oh, we lost! Oh, I went down! Oh, I bet they tried to revive me and they all died! Oh, Cody had the Wonder Waffle. I'm never gonna hear the end of this. What the fuck was that, Junior? Yeah, dude, it's like you weren't even trying. Why did you keep going down? Yeah, I had Quick Revive, and I kept trying to revive you over and over again, but you just kept going down. I had to use my monkeys, Junior, my monkeys. Are you blind? Why did you keep dying, dude? Yeah, and after you went down, we got double points, but we couldn't even use them because you just kept going down. And I had the Wonder Waffle with Pack-a-Punch. Why didn't you use your Gobble Gum? Well, I had the Gobble Gum that makes you invisible to zombies for 10 seconds, but I wasn't able to use it because Penelope turned off the TV. Oh, I know we didn't lose because of your stupid girlfriend, dude. I'm over this. Why was she mad? Because tomorrow's Valentine's Day and she wants me to get her something good. What did you get her? Well, nothing. Uh, but I, I don't know what to get her, but I lied to her and told her I got her the greatest gift ever. Maybe you should kick her in the teeth. That's the perfect gift, dude. Cody, what should I get her? I don't know. Have you tried asking her? She said that she won't tell me because I should already know what she likes. Well, I don't know what to get girls. I like wiener. Joseph, what should I get her? Dude, I don't have a girlfriend. Maybe she just kick her in the teeth. Come on, guys. Help me think of something to get her. Joseph, let's go play duos in Black Ops. Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. You're not going to invite me? <laughs> no. Well, oh, come on, guys. Oh. Who is someone that would know what Penelope likes? <gasps> her dad. And her dad's a police officer. I'm calling 911. Okay, I'm calling 911. 911, what's your emergency? Ah, someone just broke into my house and stabbed my dad five times. He's going for my mom. Come quick. Hey, somebody called the cops. Where's the killer? Oh, I lied about that. Oh, you little rascal. You really got me. I thought there was a killer here. You know, I sped here as fast as I could, ran straight over my neighbor's cat. I mean, I really creamed that little fucker. Yeah, he's probably going to bring that up at the next HOA meeting. Oh, God damn it. They're going to put speed bumps in my neighborhood, aren't they? Probably right in front of my house too so thank you thank you for that what, what do you want well i'm dating your daughter oh yeah yeah you are hey 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 quick word of advice if she's anything like her mother she's gonna grow up to be really fat and a huge bitch and she's gonna cheat on you in a walmart parking lot with a whole bunch of guys but you didn't hear that from me well tomorrow's valentine's day and i just don't know what to get her i don't know get her chocolates or a candy cane or whatever the hell girls like i don't know well, what are you going to get your wife? Well, I'd kick her in the teeth if I had legs, but I guess I'll just take her to Olive Garden. She really likes to test the limit on those unlimited breadsticks. But hey, it's a fair trade because she eats some breadsticks and then she eats my breadstick, if you know what I mean. It's the only day of the year she does that other than my birthday. And let me tell you, it is subpar. Well, I just thought since maybe she's your daughter, you would know what to get her for Valentine's Day. Listen, you're asking the wrong guy. I hate Valentine's Day. Why do you hate Valentine's Day? Oh, boy, do I have a fun little animation for you. So I was a senior in high school, and I was a bit of a ladies' man. I had made out with at least three of the girls from the chess club. Not a lot of people were going after those girls, so I volunteered. But then, one day, I decided to go after a bigger prize. Katie Knockers with the Big Ham Hawkers. She was the hottest, bustiest girl in school. You know, because of her Big Knockers, a.k.a. Ham Hawkers. It was Valentine's Day, and they had this candy gram that you could send to a girl you liked, where some of the kids from the Glee Club would sing to him and hand him a note saying you liked him and shit. So I paid the $15, and I said, send this to Katie Knockers with the Big Ham Hawkers. But one of the kids in the Glee Club, Dyslexic Dylan, wrote the wrong name down, and the candy gram was given to Deborah Dimpleass, one of the fattest, ugliest, stinkiest, resting bitch face girls in school. They gave her the candy gram and said, this is from Brooklyn Guy, and man was I so embarrassed. But Deborah loved it, I think. She wouldn't leave me alone. She came over to my house, and I tried hiding from her, but my mom answered the door, and she thought she was pregnant. And I told her, no, mom, she's just fat. But my mom made me marry her anyway. 
I always wondered what would have happened if I had given the candy gram to Katie Knockers. I heard she's a supermodel now. So that's why I hate Valentine's Day. I was just one dyslexic kid away from being with Katie Knockers with the big ham hawkers. But instead I get my big fat ugly bitch of an ex-wife. So what made you marry her? My mom made me marry her because she thought she was pregnant. I had to take care of a food baby. But yeah, later I did get her pregnant. But that's another animation for another website. So you don't have any idea what Penelope might like? Like, the whole time you've raised her, she's never said something that she likes? Well, when she was a little kid, she really liked Minnie Mouse. I mean, we could never actually afford to go to Disney World, but we would always drive down there and look at Disney World through the fence. And she would say, Daddy, can we go inside? And I'd say, no, honey, we can't afford it. Let's go. But Minnie Mouse did wave at her one time. She was very excited until security came and told us we had to leave the property. Well, I can't afford to take her to Disney World. I mean, shit, neither can I. Well, so if she likes Minnie Mouse... <gasps> What if we brought Minnie Mouse here? How are we going to do that? Well, you're a cop. Why don't you go to Disney World and say, Hey, Minnie Mouse, I need to interrogate you about a crime. And you bring Minnie Mouse here on Valentine's Day just to meet Pen Penelope, and then she'll get really excited and she'll love me. Yeah, I mean, you're right. I think she would lose her shit if she could meet Minnie Mouse. That would be the greatest gift of all time. Please do that for me. Please do that for me. Please. Okay, okay, I'll do it. But it's going to take me a day because i got to drive all the way down there. But you owe me, kid. I'm doing you a big favor here. Oh, Penelope's going to love this Valentine's Day. This is the greatest gift ever. Where is he with Minnie Mouse? Oh, hey, kid. I'm back from Disney. It was a six-hour ride there and back. Man, my balls are sore. Oh, is this your son? Uh, no. I only have a daughter. Oh, do you think your daughter will accept me as her new mommy? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm sure she's gonna love you. What was that about? Listen, man. I pull up to Disney, right? And I say, hey, Minnie, come here. Hop in my car. She hops in. No questions asked. And then on the whole six-hour drive back here, gob. She's eating my cheese. Wh what? Don't judge me. It's not the first time I banged a rat. My ex-wife was hideous. Wh isn't she married? to Mickey Mouse? Yeah, but yeah, he's not gonna find out. But listen, I need you to get Penelope here right now before Mickey realizes that Minnie's missing. Uh, okay, I'll do that. Wh who's that? What if it's Mickey? Wait, you turned your location off, right? No! Oh, you bitch. What if we just tell him about us? He'll understand. N no, no, he, he won't understand our love between a human and a mouse. That That's absurd. Oh, you're right. We can just tell him later. Yeah, later. We'll tell him later. For right now, we'll just say you're doing a meet and greet and we're paying you, okay? So just, just sit right there. Okay. Okay, kid, get Penelope here right now. I'm gonna go distract Mickey. Uh, hello? Hello? Oh, hiya, pal. Is Minnie Mouse here? Oh, no, there's no Minnie here. Don't <laughs> go wait in the car. I'll call you and Goofy if I need you. <laughs> Listen, ma'am, I tracked Minnie's location here. Why is she here on Valentine's Day? Listen, man, I think there's been a big misunderstanding. You see, my daughter's a big Minnie Mouse fan, so I paid Minnie to do a meet and greet here. Oh! Well, Minnie doesn't do business under the table without me. Oh, she was doing some business under the table. Oh, well, how about I go to your house and sleep with your wife? I mean, hey, have at it, man. Oh, Goofy, go bang this man's wife. With pleasure, Mickey. Goofy's on his way to bang your wife. Look, let's just come inside. Oh, Goofy will. He doesn't pull out. No, no, I mean, come inside and I'll take you to Minnie. See, there she is. Minnie, what are you doing here? Oh, Mickey, I'm here to meet this man's daughter for a meet and greet. No, you're not, Minnie. I told you you're not doing business without me. We're going back to Disney World right now. Wait, wait, wait. Can't you just meet my daughter first? Yeah, please. No! Oh, come on, Mickey. They're paying me. How much? Uh, $1,000. Where's the money? Um, I, 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 I cash apped it. Let me see your cash app. Uh, I, I logged out because it was being weird. So now, oh, wait, my phone's ringing. Maybe it's cash app. Hello? Boy, you'll never guess who is at the front door. Who? It's Goofy. Goofy. Karen, don't answer the door. Oh, I already did, Boyney. Okay, but don't let him in. Oh, this is such a lovely house. Can I see the bedroom? Yeah, it's down the hall. Oh, Karen, don't show him the bedroom. Oh, what a bouncy bed. You want to bounce on it with me? Sure. Hold on, Boyney. I'm going to put the phone down. No, 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 Karen, Karen, don't. Take your clothes off. It's easier to bounce that way. No, Karen, don't do that. Go hook. Go hook. Go hook. Goofy's at my house banging my wife. I told you Goofy doesn't play. She's part of the goof troop now. Kid, where the hell is Penelope? <gasps> that must be her. Okay, I'll go, I'll go, I'll go answer the door. Hello? Happy Valentine's Day, Junior. I got you a Hello Kitty. Oh, exactly what I like. Hello Kitty. You like cats, Junior? Yeah, I, I guess. Okay, what'd you get me? Well, I got you a meet and greet with a really famous girl. <gasps> oh my God, who? Billie Eilish? No. Oh. Someone you've always wanted to meet and greet with. Okay. Come on up. I got you a meet and greet with Minnie Mouse. Oh, Minnie Mouse? Yeah, remember Penelope? You said you love Minnie Mouse. Yeah, when I was like five. But remember that one time she waved at you through the gate for free? You waved at them for free? I'm sorry, Mickey. You know we don't wait at poor people. Your time is up. Minnie, let's get out of here. Mickey, before we go, there's something I have to tell you. Oh, no, no, no.
No, we don't need to tell him anything. Oh, yeah, maybe you will. What is it? Well, me and this man, we're in love. Get her what? Dad? Yeah, she, she doesn't know what she's talking about. We made love multiple times. Get her what? Dad? Listen, Goofy's railing my wife right now, so I think we're even. Oh, yeah? Well, I've got to go rail your wife now, too. Dad? Please don't. Oh, now we can be together forever. Oh, God, I'm getting a phone call. Let's put that on speaker. Hello? <laughs> Give her my steamboat, Willie! Bill it, Mickey! Oh, hot dog! Oh, oh. Let me have a turn, Mickey! No, Goofy, move out of the way! I'm still going! Oh, oh. <laughs> Donald, but still crowded over here! Go to the other side! Oh. Why didn't you give me that choice, Mickey? Because Donald's small! Uh, you know what? I think I'm just gonna hang out. Yeah? I'll see you at home, though. Wait, baby, wait for me! I'm so sorry I caused all this. I just didn't know what to get you for Valentine's Day. Thanks for the Hello Kitty. I'll, I'll leave you alone. Okay. What in the actual hell did I just witness? What the hell did I just witness? That was so wrong on so many levels. <laughs> I don't know what to say. I, I, I'm speechless. I don't know what to say. That was so weird. What the hell, man? What the hell? Okay. Okay. That's about question. Who was you? Was your Valentine? My girlfriend. My girlfriend. Uh, gamer girl, girl twenty three Tina TikTok. My that. My girlfriend, that's what I'd have to say, but uh, this is probably going to be it, guys. Uh, I'm gone, guys. Okay. Thank you, everybody, so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed this, leave a like, put a comment, and subscribe. I will see you guys. I'll see you guys tomorrow. I'm making a, making a Spider-Man Friend or Foe video tomorrow. I'm gone, y'all. God, bye. <laughs>